Okay, so for the wind gait, again, uh, Lindsay is going to be our subject. Her body weight is 70.5 kilograms. Her height is 158 centimeters. Uh, so for the resistance, what we will do is take her body mass in kilograms and multiply it by 7.5% or 0.75. So that shows here. So the kilogram the resistance we will use during the test is 5.25 kilograms. Um, we will also calculate one third of that resistance, which we will use sort of in the ramping up phase pre-test. She will cycle all out at 1.75 kilograms before we then immediately load on the full 5.25, at which point she will cycle as fast as she can for 30 seconds. Um, what we will do is count the number of pedal revolutions that she performs during that 30 seconds, and we'll break it up so that we'll have two people, two counters, one will count for five seconds, and then the other one will take over for the next five seconds, and they'll basically alternate back and forth, each counting for three five-second periods for the total of 30 seconds, and we're gonna record those here um, on the lab, okay? Um, after that, we will then use the peak force, which I calculated here, so I took the kilogram resistance used during the test times 9.8067 to give us 51.5 newtons, that's the force. Revolutions max will be the highest number that we see in revolutions times six meters. And the reason why we do that is because that is the distance of the flywheel of the Monarch Cycle Ergometer. One trip around is the equivalent of six meters. So in order to calculate the power, we need to know force times distance. So if we know she went around, say, six times, one time is six meters, that would give us 36 meters total travel during that uh, given five second time period. Okay, so we'll calculate once we finish peak anaerobic power, lowest anaerobic power, and then we'll calculate her relative power and then what her fatigue index is, and those calculations are all found on your lab, and I'll talk about them a little bit more uh, in the lecture component. So we're gonna take a quick pause and go ahead and just knock this Wingate test out.